So you may have seen uh, the latest math equation that's gone viral, and you might think, hmm, the answer could be 1 or it could be 9. Uh, and which is it? Anytime you might see an equation like this, you might think to yourself, oh, I just have to follow the order of operations, right? PEMDAS, parentheses, then exponents, then multiplication and division, addition and subtraction. But they're tricking you here with the way that they spaced the, the numbers around the division sign. So that you have this perceptual cue that you should actually group the six in one side, almost like in the numerator of a fraction, and then the rest of the uh, equation in the denominator. And so you'd have six over two times one plus two, or six over two times three, which is six divided by six, which is one. Um, so if you got one, it's totally fine. It's a natural perceptual cue. Your brain's actually picking up based on the spacing information, uh, but the true answer is actually none. This problem is designed in a way that's honestly meant to trick you so that it would go viral, and that's why it does. But we have to remember the multiplication and division are actually inverse operations. We have to work them together left to right. Multiplication doesn't always come before division. So if you look at the problem, you see first, well, 1 plus 2, that's going to be 3. Right. Now is where the trick comes. So we have to work them together left to right. 6 divided by 2 is 3. 3 times 3 is 9. That's actually the correct answer uh, by the rule of the law. 